Hi guys, it's Sunday today. Hi! I'm currently taking care of my boyfriend's cat. He is visiting back home, so I will be taking care of Mr. Chiller. Hi, Jungkook! I actually have some update for you guys. In the end of September, which is the end of this month, there will be a kitten arriving at my crib. Yeah, my dream is to have like at least two to three cats living with me. I don't know, call me crazy if you want, but that's the agenda. So, but before that, I actually got some cat supplies and stuff like that I need to unbox. I have been fostering cats for about three to four years now so i've accumulated a bunch of stuff on my own but i did also get some food because i was running out and a cat food dispenser and i've never owned one actually and i'm going to unbox them i honestly don't even know if this is the right package i got some new kibbles oopsies my camera died um but my Cat food dispenser actually was not here yet, but there's some other stuff. I got sunscreen for my California trip since I will be outdoors a lot. I actually need to work on my habit of wearing body sunscreen and I need to protect my tattoos. So here they are. I'm making salmon, but it smells like it's burning, so. scared me i'm making salmon specifically the infamous emily mariko salmon rice i've actually never made it before which is a surprise to me i am also going to make a kale salad they've been in my fridge for a while and i really need to eat it key to good kale salad is First, you need to de-stem it. Second, you need to either blanch it or you're going to do what I will show you next. My fire alarm just went off. But as I was saying, you're gonna grab a bowl, put it in. You only need your hands. Good olive oil. You're going to drizzle it on and you're gonna need salt and pepper. Put some salt in there first. A big squeeze of lemon juice. I'm just gonna massage it like this. Don't be afraid to get in there because you actually want to use your fingers and pretend that they're your teeth. Fingers are actually pre-chewing the fiber to make them softer and easier to digest. Dinner is served. My salad. I added some truffle goat cheese, some ham, and some arugula. Here is Emily Mariko salmon rice. Of course, seaweed. Mm. I over salted the salmon, I think, but that's fine. I don't know about you, but I'm always the type of person that needs to watch something when I eat. I give up. My friend Cynthia gave me this as a gift for my birthday this year. It smells like plums. I walked by a blind box figurine store today when I was in Greenpoint. When I walked by it for the first time, I was like, I cannot go in and spend money. But when I was walking back to train station but right, for the second time and i couldn't help myself okay so it's actually called my plastic heart anyways this is addiction for me this is what addiction looks like a miffy 
phone stand series. There's double sofas and single sofas. And you can put your phone on that sofa like this with a little figure. Isn't that so cute? I can. And I weighed every single one of them to see which one is heavier because I really want to get a double sofa so I can put my phone horizontally like this. Or I could like put a doll next to it. Moment of truth. It's a fucking double sofa. It's the one I wanted. So cute. And it's like a little floaty, I think. You can put it on water or something. This is adorable. Take my money. Take my money. Mm, isn't it cute? I'm either going to put it on my desk or I'm going to put this my nightstand oh my god it's so cute or i can put it at my makeup station because i like to watch videos when i do my makeup like this next one this is the best friend series of Kuromi and Melody. If you don't know me, I love Sanrio. As is every girl. But this one is insane. It actually comes with a pair. It comes with a little stand. It's not a pair, it's a single one. I'm so confused. Oh, it's not the one I wanted. Okay, it's not bad. It's Melody on the phone on a sofa i was debating of whether i should get this one because i thought it was a pair or if i should get a series of bubble bath which is samuel characters taking bubble bath and it was so cute and this one's more expensive and i was like oh it might be more expensive because it's a pair tricked but it's okay she just like me on the phone all the time sometimes you win some and you lose some right at least it's not like a terrible pull and i also went to kettle for the first time which is a matcha shop and i got a little jar of matcha powder for my boyfriend's mom as a gift just as a little thank you gesture gym this morning came back showered had lunch did my laundry i'm still kind of hungry i think i'm gonna make a smoothie when i was coming back from the gym our elevator was broken for some reason and i had to take five flights of stairs to get up here hey my cat food automatic dispensary is here This shit is huge, girl. Ooh, it's so cute. You need to check the size of the kibble and see if 
it will fit in this diameter. And if it doesn't, then your kibbles won't go through. This is the bowl. So apparently I need to put this somewhere that could be plugged in for electricity to run this thing. Dinner time! I'm so hungry. I made gochujang pasta. I've never made this before and it was surprisingly really easy. One of the true recipes that are actually under 10 minutes to make. All the other ones, lies. And I made some arugula salad with goat cheese and parmesan. And I also marinated some beef with burgundy sauce. Your girl's gotta get her protein in. Mmm, what is spread? And leftover smoothie. Apparently you're supposed to eat your veggies first because they're easier to digest and that's how you avoid bloating when you eat. I don't know if this is true. Mmm, that's yummy. Devoured. Doesn't it look so good? Mm. Holy shit. I put five cloves of garlic in here, so this shit better be good. And it is so good. It's a very familiar taste. It tastes like spicy Korean rice cake. And really good shin ramen the black package the luxury one their combo their baby but in pasta form this is the recipe from eric kim from new york times cooking and i've seen this video of people just making it or reels of people just making it on the internet i need to know what this hype is about and i did not disappoint you can also make it with instant ramen i figured i'd use these jiggly short ones so that it could catch up on the sauce better since this is like not a very like creamy runny pasta sauce it's very like pungent it's, it has a cake to it and it tastes kind of like korean rice cake sauce but cooked down i watched the past life yesterday it was okay it wasn't crazy good or it wasn't like crazy bad i enjoyed watching it it's a good movie to watch if you have downtime and just want to like chill with your partner or your friends 
or your family even. And, oh, and I saw another movie yesterday. I watched two movies yesterday. I watched Element City, which is the new Pixar movie, I think, which is a movie animated about all these elements living in this city called Element City. And it was a story about a water boy and a fire girl. And it was so much fun. I really enjoyed it. I'm not gonna spill. I think that one was a really good one.